Hey, what's up you guys? This is Sentai22 here and this is pretty much my uh, late response to the Toonami April Fools that occurred uh, just three weeks ago. Um, you know, we, you know how to not, you know how Adult Swim on a, every April Fools uh, day they have been showing the movie The Room, you know, Tommy Wiseau. You're tearing me apart, Lisa! Oh, hi, camera. Hi, YouTube. This is Tommy Wiseau, and this is my show. <laughs> Sorry, my my Tommy Wiseau impression isn't the best in the world, but I definitely tried. So, when they were showing the room, and at the at the beginning they start showing Tom not the happy face Tom from the last tsunami that closed down but the actual awesome Tom with the helmet awesome you know and I was very ecstatic I mean I didn't believe anybody uh, when I first heard about it I mean I thought that this was an April Fool's prank that was put on the forums but then I saw the promos on YouTube and I was like whoa it's Gundam yeah promos of Gundam and they were showing promos of DBZ and Tenchi Muyo and Outlaw Star and I was like damn it I missed it man like man you guys you really it was just unexpected to be honest with you and I think that bringing that blog back was was truly was one of the mem most memorable things that was a part of my life uh, throughout the past childhood and um, I think it's great uh, to see this back again although I really doubt it'll come back and I don't like to burst anyone's bubble here but they will never be a tsunami I mean, I can understand why people want it back, you know, to bring anime back to TV. But in reality, look, back then when Toonami was awesome and was great, we didn't have internet, we didn't have high-speed internet to watch our animes. We didn't have like a third-party source to get our anime stuff from. Toonami was, you, you could say, that void for us. And now that anime has become excessively available, there is no really a need. I mean, if you think about it, Adult Swim on Saturday nights in itself was basically a tsunami. I mean, how would you, th how would a format change to tsunami would work? Actually, I, I don't really get it. I mean, it it ain't gonna work. I mean, if you want to put some, you know. American programming like Star Wars or Ben 10, that's fine, but I really doubt, you know, putting anime on that block is not going to work. Again, you have so much services now as you did 10 or 15 years ago that there's no really a need for Toonami. But if you guys want it, just go on Twitter. You know, that's all I have to say about that. I mean, I just don't really know. I mean, if there is a need for anime, then yeah, I mean, the, the block should be there, but it ain't gonna happen because, like I said before, there's so much availability now. You can get your anime pretty much everywhere, legally. Netflix, Hulu, and if you want to be an outlaw, you can get them illegally, too, from illegally streaming websites, you know? That's the harsh reality right there, guys. I'm sorry, but, I mean, if you... If they bring back Toonami, it's not going to be the same as it used to be. I mean, if they bring it back as... They might bring it back as a Saturday block, not as a weekday block. I mean, even if they bring it back as a weekday block, it is not going to work. I mean, they probably put it in prime time, but again, it's not going to work. It's not going to really... I mean, if you guys want it, I mean, I certainly, I certainly would, but... Again, it's not going to work. I give it maybe like a year or two before it, it shuts off, in my opinion. But I'm hopeful. I really am. I hope that, you know, we can see another anime boom in the next few years, which, you know, anime has been dying in the U.S. for quite a long time. Uh, but let's just see. I mean, I don't know the future, but let's just hope that the future is a bright one. Alright guys, that's about it. Hope you guys join me next time for my next vlog as well as uh, reviews and all that great stuff. So, 
This is Sentai22, and uh, thanks for watching.